You gotta get rid of those satellite dishes for me. Cable's better anyways, yeah, I'm you game. know? What are you looking at? Nothing. Well, it looks like you're looking at me, scumbag. Like I said, nothing. Oh, come on, I don't want to fight you. My name's Jimmy. Zoe. I was at Bullworth once. I got kicked out. Why? Let's just say Mr. Burton is a dirty creep. Seriously? I would love to teach that guy a lesson. He bullies everyone. You know, he goes jogging every day and regularly uses the porta potties in the park. Yuck. Yeah, so if we could catch him in one on top of a hill, then Mr. Burton could have a really interesting time in it. Yeah, but they're all chained together. We'll need to get some bolt cutters. Go get some from the Spaz Industries building and meet me at the park. Make sure no one sees you. for me. Get the 
gotta get creep! Oh, cool. Coming with me! Did you get them? Yeah, I got them. Now what? Burton always goes to the can when he goes running. We've got to make sure he uses this one and send him on a trip. I'll take care of this. You make sure he doesn't use one of the other ones. This sounds like it's gonna be good. That's that nonsense dealt with. Jimmy, buddy, I need your help. Working hard in class, I Someone think. needs to send those preps a message. Tag up that part of town. Can you do it? Absolutely necessary. Brilliant. That'll show them.
English class is paying off. Pretty good. Could I write him a prescription for a hundred and fifty grams? Smart. Oh, fuck, this city was civil. What's so civil about it? Stop that. No, acting out like this won't make your daddy. is where we do the tune-ups, and that doesn't involve a car. So, is it worth it, now that you're gonna get busted and all? Oh, here he is, Mr. Big. Yeah, it was you, creep. What was me? Don't play innocent with us. I tried that when Father caught me with Nanny. He gave me a good thrashing, and I've got half a mind to give you one. Hey, look, just get to the point. Someone stole our boxing trophies, buddy. They were heirlooms. Well, it wasn't me, rich boy, so relax. Well, if it wasn't you, then who was it? I bet it was those grease balls. I know it. They've always hated us. And so much for peace in our time, Popper. Just great. Let's get them. Yes. It's time to teach those poor, disrespectful scum a lesson. Wait, relax. Maybe it wasn't them. Maybe it was someone else. Nobody hates us. Apart from them. Oh, yeah, they do. Everyone hates you. You're all awful. Oh, la-dee-da. Now he tells us. You are pathetic, Hopkins. You're not a leader. Out of my way. Come on, men. Let's go. Okay. It's war. Hold on. Wait here. I'll go get your trophy back from those grease balls. Oh, man. Vance, did you guys steal the preppy's trophies? No way, man. After the townie's been saying all that stuff about Lola and made Johnny crazy, we don't care about those stuck-up jerks. 
The townies? Really? Yeah, and Johnny says you're no friend of ours anymore. But since you got him out, I'll let you walk away from this meeting. Well, since I already beat you, I guess I believe you. That's my ride, loser. You think you're original? Not so Mine. big now, are you? If you dented my crop, I swear... Forget this. Come on, hero. Walk tall, don't ya? You're cruising Come on, hero. Walk tall, don't, don't ya? Think about Girls, <laughs> hurry up! Can't be late for the party. All right, come on! They're burning those trophies down at the docks.
and call that a fight? Well, Pauper, what did you find? Yeah, who took our trophies? Don't tell me. It was the Tooth Fairy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> either it was the Tooth Fairy or the Grease Balls. I wonder which one. Actually, trust fun babies. It was neither. It was those townies. Which townies? The ones who hang out by the factory. Them? Why would they steal our trophies? Don't talk crap, Hopkins. I'm not. I've got a picture to prove it. Why? They don't have any problems with us. Yeah, poor kids just love rich kids who act like stuck-up jerks, don't they? Listen, you over-fortunate numbskull. They did everything. Put Johnny Vincent in the home, let the rats out of the library, everything, including your trophies. Why? Because I listened to Gary. So it is your fault. No, it was Gary's fault. You, my friend, have got delusions of grandeur. Nobody cares about you or Gary. You're ridiculous. Come on, Biff. Let's leave this king of this school to his pathetic little fantasies. You are an idiot, Hopkins. I've got a photograph. You know what you can do with that, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm worried about my grades. I was a little late with the special success. There was never any doubt. Six times this week. Lame. Figurine and dope like this. Say what you like. 